Are you prepping for a product manager interview? One of the things that we love about consulting is that a lot of people that are candidates for consulting are also looking at other roles and product manager roles have natural fits with the consulting skill set. They're very strategic, they're very collaborative, they're very analytical, and they're also focused on delivering results just like consulting is. So if you're looking at both or if you're just looking at product management, we'd love to help. We walk you through 12 key questions and answers for the product manager interview, why you should think about becoming a product manager, and ultimately, how you can get into the job if that's something that you're interested in. Great, rich, interesting episode for you today. Hope you enjoy it. If you're looking to land your dream job as a product manager, make sure you're ready for product manager interview questions. In this video, we're going to talk through some common product manager interview questions and answers, and we'll highlight how to get the dream job that you're looking for. Specifically, we've helped hundreds of candidates work through this product management interview process and to help them successfully land top jobs at places like Amazon, Google, and more. By the end of this episode, you'll have a better understanding of what product management interview questions to expect, how to address them, and how to personalize your stories so that you can showcase your skills inside a product management interview. Let's dive in. First of all, it's important to understand a product manager's role. A product manager thinks through plans, processes, and implements a product strategy, features, and ultimately even some of its technical design. They're really responsible for the end-to-end -end production of product, especially inside technical organizations. Product managers work closely with cross-functional teams, including engineering and IT. They work with sales. They work across marketing. They really focus on the end-to-end -end process to deliver something from concept all the way to you, the customer, in the market. Now, there are a few different questions for the product manager that are important for you to know. And as I read a few of these out, just pay attention to which ones you have answers for already and which ones you don't. And we would recommend that you actually have written answers for every one of these questions, not so that you can memorize them, but so you have a common fact sheet, a story base that you can refer to as you're preparing for consistent product manager interviews. Let's dive in. First of all, there are background and experience questions. These really highlight why you want to do the job and what you've done before. Product manager roles are really dependent on experience and they don't expect that you're coming in fresh. They expect that you've done something in product management before. First of all, can you tell me about your previous experience as a product manager? Second, what motivated you to become a product manager? Third, how do you keep up with industry trends and changes? The point of all of these questions is for you to have a one minute response prepared that highlights not just the background and the interim, the kind of application of your skills and experiences, but also really what success brought you to where you are today. Next, we have product vision and strategy questions. These are really harnessing some of the insights and applying them inside the interview. Number one, how would you define the product vision and strategy for our company? This can't be just read out verbatim from the website. You actually have to put some thought into this. Number two, how do you prioritize features and decide what to include in a roadmap? Now, they're not just looking for what you have done before, but they're looking for a specific example that illuminates a process that you use consistently. Number three, how do you measure the success of a product? When you think through different realms of success and the measurements that you use, you want to probably talk them through a specific product, how you measured it, and even how you refined the measurement metrics. If you're looking to break into product management roles, Management Consulted can help. We have amazing coaches on our staff who have aced the product management interview process. They're former product managers and they'd love to work with you one-on-one -on -one to help you prepare for PM interviews. So head to the link in the show notes to learn more about what it takes to join and to work with our team. All right, let's continue with this episode. Number three, there are collaboration and leadership questions. One of the challenges that product managers have inside an organization is that they have to fight for the attention of many different people, none of whom directly report to them. And so they're looking for ways that you have highlighted some of those skills to collaborate with others. Number one, 
Can you give an example of a time that you had to collaborate with different teams to launch a product? Now, if you've been a product manager before, you better be ready to answer this question. But you can't just say, yes, I can. You need to say, absolutely, I've got lots of examples, but here's one good one. Number two, how do you handle conflicts within a team? You want to talk here about a time when a lot of people who were well-intentioned, you don't want to throw anybody under the bus, were competing for priorities and focusing on different things and how you managed to be the one who facilitated the resolution of the conflict at the end. Number three, how do you motivate and lead a team to achieve a common goal. Again, a great story is necessary here, not just your methods, but your methods illuminated in a specific process. Number four, the technical and analytical questions. Now you've gotta be ready for these. They wanna see that you've got the technical chops to actually do the job. Number one, what's your experience with data analysis and using data to make decisions? You are an expert, let me just tell you. And if you're not, go be an expert before you walk into these interviews. But you don't have to be perfect. You just need to explain that you regularly use it, you're comfortable use it, you like using it, and you need to explain a specific situation where you use not one, but multiple forms of data analysis. Number two, can you walk me through how you approach product testing and validation? Again, you're looking through your background and your experience, but here you're looking for a success story, a way that you incorporated the metrics of a product test and validation into the final design. Finally, how do you prioritize tech debt and address it within a product roadmap? This is a really important and specific issue. Tech debt is a huge problem for organizations. And so thinking about it ahead of time, they're looking for your ability to incorporate strategy in the long run. This is really a test for future level positions, not just the one that you're applying for today. So lots of great questions, right? 12 core questions for every product manager interview that you have to be ready to answer. You need one minute prepared answers, punchy, focused, um, focusing on a lot of your different experiences. You never want to cover one experience more than once because you want to get the sense that you're the kind of person who walks into every single situation, 12 different situations. You're always following the same enthusiastic, structured, clear process. But there are a few key tips three in particular that we have for candidates that are preparing for a product manager interview. First of all, research the company and its products thoroughly. They may ask you for a deeper dive on a specific product, and you don't just want to do a one-minute Google review. You actually want to think through all of the things that went into creating that product. You might want to look up its history. You might want to look up the staff that was on it and understand some of the input that got it to where it is today. Understanding its story is going to help you tell yours. Second, it's critical to practice answering these key interview questions. Even if as I read out the questions, you thought, I've got an answer, I've got an answer, I've got an answer. The difference between a one minute answer and a five minute answer is the job or not. You need to be able to not just answer the question, but communicate your answer in a way that connotes that you have senior executive authority and the ability to communicate to persuade. Number three, the questions that you ask at the end of a product manager interview are required to be thoughtful, insightful, and what we use at Management Consulted is a PSP framework, personal, specific, and positive. You want to ask questions not about the broader direction about the company, but about that person's specific experience, about their specific technical roadmap, about who they manage and how they enjoy working with them. You want to have positive, specific, and personal questions at the end of your interview so that you can dazzle and delight your interviewer with a great conversation after they have led it. Now you're leading an awesome conversation too. In the end, we have amazing preparation tools for product manager interviews, and we would love to help you dive in. We have coaches who can work with you. We have videos that can help you. And of course, we can work with you through a full prep plan and process to break into product manager roles. If you've got questions about product management, we would love to help you. At Management Consulted, you can reach us by following the links in the show notes or by reaching out directly. Thanks again for joining. If you want to become a product manager, we can help. 
At Management Consulted, we can help you with coaching, preparation, and planning for your entire product manager interview process. So make sure that you reach out through either joining Black Belt or just reaching out to our team directly, team at managementconsulted.com. If you've got ideas for future interviews, feedback about the pod, or if you just want to share it, you can always reach us directly or you can subscribe, comment, and like what we do. Thanks again for joining and being a part of the massive community of people that we are so honored to be able to support.